St. John's magical run ended on Saturday as the Division II state runner-up. And while not the outcome the Titans wanted, this team still exceeded expectations just by making it to Columbus. With a 9-7 regular season record, St. John's had earned the seven seed in their region, but promptly rattled off five straight wins, including two comebacks to punch their ticket to state. Making for a season, head coach Andy Smith won't soon forget. It's really, really special group. We had that rough stretch in the middle of the season and to see our guys rebound from that and, and get gritty and get resilient, go into the playoffs, even the games leading into the playoffs, I didn't think we played particularly well. And it was part of that hangover of that tough stretch. So for them to have our guys really buckle down and make that decision, I've been asking them all year long that they had to just choose that they wanted to be great and they could start to, to watch it happen. And I watched them slowly make that choice and choose to be great. And one game at a time, I watched them get a little better and a little better and a little better, and it got us to here. And now we know what the difference is between what we were and what we can be going forward. I always meet with our seniors in the offseason, and I ask them, what kind of season do you want? Do you want to put in championship-level effort? I told this senior class, I went to them and I said, hey, there's a certain level it would take to be champions this year, and, it, and it's going to take uh, a certain level of dedication, and I outlined that all for them, kind of knowing what it looks like. And they said, that's, that's an awful lot, Coach. Can we go first? For, for this amount of effort and we'll see what we can get from there. And little by little they started to believe and they started to work a little harder and get those opportunities. And then something clicked and they just gelled and they worked together um, and it was great to watch.